guys, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so tonight we want to get into this Erica Banks and Finesse Two Times story that was kind of going viral over the last couple of days. If you don't know who Erica Banks is, this is her right here in the background. What you're looking at, she went viral on TikTok and she made, she made music, but she went viral on TikTok with one of her um hit songs called Bust It. Bust It, Bust It. Is you fucking two shots? Fuck it, pussy. Okay, that's the song right there without the music. I was just giving y'all a little snippet so y'all could get a gist of the song that I'm talking about because of copyright uh, reasons why I didn't play the full, you know, music. So her boyfriend went on the well, her ex boyfriend went on the Breakfast Club and he got asked why did him and Erica Banks break up, and he had a good bit of things to say. As to why they broke up. Uh, well, it kind of sounds like it all boils down. Basically, she is a masculine presented female. And a lot of men these days do not like masculine presented female or independent female. And she's very independent. But also, um, I think he just want a little too much. I get what he's trying to say. He really want a, a girly girl, feminine type girl to um, basically cater to him. Or basically submit to him is what he really sh want to say, but the way it's coming off is like she said, you want to he wants a servant. So I'm going to let y'all hear what he has to say, and then I'll come back and show y'all what she has to say, and y'all let me know what do y'all think. I honestly don't think she's wrong for anything that she had to say, and I feel like. He wants what he wants, and like she said, she just wasn't the one that could give it to him, and that's okay too. It's always okay. Like, fine, it's somebody out there that will do exactly what he wants, but it's just not her. And for those of you who don't know who Finesse Two Times is, here's a snippet of one of his hit songs, and then after that, I'll let y'all hear what the interview was about. It's a problem when I do it. Fuck em. Birds of a feather, they fuck together. They what happened between you and Erica Banks? Oh, uh -oh. Since, since we're talking about the women, uh, it's cool when they do it. I'm <laughs> <laughs> pull like this. I'm pull like this. I'm pull like this. I'm okay. pull like this. I'm pull like this. It was it was something I wanted to do, and you know what I'm saying. Um, the age thing. That was, mm -hmm. that's, that's the thing I didn't I didn't understand. Like she older than you? Nah, she younger yeah, than me. Okay, okay. You know what I'm saying. You know I'm a man, mm -hmm. so. When I wake up in the morning and me and my woman get up, when I get up, my woman get up because it's time to cook, it's time to have some sex, it's time to clean up. And when you get up and you get in your phone, I don't like that. Mm -hmm. Don't get straight in your phone when you're around a man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? When you get up, you're going to get up and take her your man, then get in your phone. What happened between? You want I'm not going to call my wife sis. Exactly. <laughs> you, know you see what, what I'm saying? saying? But nobody says sis. Nobody says no, sis. No, but, but yes, they do. People say sis. My brother say sis all the time. He called my gal sis. What's up, sis? Yeah. Some things just be out of force of habit. No, you don't do she it. You don't say bro. But guess what? She okay. work in a male-dominated industry. She probably says bro a lot. So. No, nah, but guess what? Eight out of ten women I'd admit that was 27, 28, 29, 30 years old, they don't call me and bro. Do you think that's just some young young woman? Yeah. Got gotcha. you. Yeah, it's just so and it wasn't no big issue. It was just like, don't do that. Yeah. And then when you do it again, don't do that. And also as a as a partner, Little I want my partner that. to call me something a little more intimate. Baby, yeah. bro. Yeah, bro, yeah, it just you know sounds crazy. Yeah. I get it. I yeah, get it. Yeah, like, like, you make me feel like you just the partner. Yeah, imagine y'all making love and she's like, bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, bro. <laughs> <laughs> or you get up from having sex and she say, "Why well, right then, bro?" That's kind of crazy. For next two times, we appreciate you for joining us, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate y'all having me, bro. For <laughs> next two times, is the Breakfast Club. Good morning. Yeah. So then she caught one of the interview, and this is what she has to say. Oh, let me give y'all my side of the finesse thing, right? So, there's a difference. Difference between a good woman and a maid. There's a difference between a good woman and a do girl. <laughs> you get where I'm going? And so, with Finesse, Finesse wants a servant. 
Okay, his whole thing was, when I get up, she's supposed to get up and bathe me and clean me and cook and roll a blunt and straighten up and da 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 da. And that's cool. He is absolutely right. However, just because you just open your eyes don't mean I'm about to open my eyes and get up and get the. Ooh, no, I'm tired too. Don't let me be tired from the night before. Don't let me have had a video shoot or some shit I was doing the day before. Oh, you might not see me till about 12 o'clock. <laughs> okay? And, like, in 2023, y'all know, like, a lot of shit happened on the phone. Bookings happen on the phone. Money is calling from what? The phone. They hit what to give you some bread? The phone. So, I'm going to get up, make sure everybody's straight, check on my people, check on my account, see if we got some new money today. And then we can get up and talk about what you want to eat for breakfast. <laughs> or, you know, what you want to do today or whatever. So, yeah, this is on a servant who going to get up and goddamn get on their knees and, and kiss his toes. And I'm just not that girl. I'm not that girl. Like, it's somebody out there for him to do that. So, let me get y'all my... Okay, so y'all hear what they both had to say. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments about the situation. Um, give me a thumbs up and subscribe.